Welcome back, Coil Pack, to another Click Team Firefly tutorial. Today we'll be going over how to full screen your games. Um, the first thing we're going to do is select the application, and in the properties, we're going to go to the Windows tab and deselect everything that is checked. And then we want to select Maximize on Boot Up and Resize Display of Fill Window Size. Now, we're going to go ahead and add everything in first. So we're going to need the window control object. We're going to add, go to the Firefly tab and add the engine, the camera, and we're going to have a primitive just for viewing. Now, if you were to run this now, you'll see that the primitive has hard edges, kind of pixel-like, rather than being smooth. So in order to fix that, the first thing we're going to do is select the engine and uncheck Start Engine at Start. And then we're going to go over to the Event Editor, and we're going to create three start of frame lines. In the first one, we're going to set up the window control object. So we're going to change the frame window, and we're going to set the width to the horizontal size of the client area. And we're going to set this value to 1. That way it adjusts and changes to the window size. And then we're going to go and change or set up the height, which will be the vertical size of the client. And again, value will be 1. And we're going to be using those two lines a lot. Um, we're going to set the engine and the camera up to those values. So in the second line, we're going to stop the engine. We're going to set the engine resolution, and the width will be the horizontal, and the height will be the vertical. And then we're going to set up the camera. Same thing. The width is the horizontal, and the height is the vertical. And we're also going to set up the aspect ratio. And that will be the camera object's height, or sorry, the object's width, times 1, divided by the object's height. And basically what that sets up is it gives the program a more exact value for calculating the resolution or the ratio aspect ratio of the camera rather than giving it a default four thirds or four over three or sixteen nine. And in the last starter frame, oh, we also have to start the engine. And then in the last starter frame, we're going to go to the camera, viewports, and remove all from Firefly engine stack. We're going to select the engine, and then we're going to add everything back into the engine. So viewport add for the camera, and then for the primitive, we're just going to add it and then select the engine. And basically what that does is takes it out of the engine and then puts it back in with the engine full screen for whatever screen it's playing on. It gets rid of the hard edges. Um, I'm not, I'll try, but you're not going to be able to view um, the full screen because of the way I record. But what you can see, you can see that we don't have any hard edges. And then if I was to deactivate this code and do the same thing, I have to start the engine first. If I was to do the same thing, you'll see that it's kind of misformed and it has the hard edges around the sides. But that's it for today's tutorial, guys. I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, I will be going over loading screens or like a pause menu or something for Firefly since Firefly overlaps all 2D objects. Thank you guys for watching.